Enterprise IT contributes significantly to the world's carbon footprint. Its impact on the environment is comparable to major emitters of CO2 like coal power plants or cars on the road. Yes, indeed. If it were a country, then Enterprise IT would be the third biggest consumer of energy in the world, and the demand is increasing every day. We believe that protecting the climate should be one of the biggest drivers for change in Enterprise IT. As IT leaders, you cannot expect the organizations you work for to build sustainable businesses unless IT is a part of that journey. Right now, there's a powerful movement both to minimize the impact of enterprise IT on the climate and to use technology as a solution to deliver sustainability. We call this opportunity Sustainable IT. There is an urgent need to act on this. We need sustainable IT strategies with ambitious and concrete targets. We need to select the right actions, not succumb to the wrong good ideas. We need employees with sustainability culture and necessary expertise for sustainable IT implementation. And we should select and scale sustainable IT solutions that help business to be more sustainable. It is important to create strong foundations by measuring the carbon footprint of your enterprise IT today and setting ambitious targets for the coming years. And I must add that only a complete diagnosis will identify the right levers for change, from hardware to applications and data, along with topics like sustainable sourcing and other considerations throughout the project lifecycle. We invite you to follow our in-depth analysis of the current state of awareness and adoption of sustainable IT, the typical challenges and how the leaders are overcoming these challenges to achieve strong outcomes. Exactly. It is no surprise that these outcomes are not solely limited to reduce carbon footprint or improve ESG scores, but also extend to cost savings, improve brand image, and increase employee retention.